The Apollo 11 mission, a landmark event in human history, marked the first time humans set foot on the moon. This monumental achievement, realized on July 20, 1969, was the culmination of years of intense effort, innovation, and determination by NASA and its team of dedicated scientists, engineers, and astronauts. The Apollo program was initiated in response to President John F. Kennedy's bold challenge as he stood before Congress on May 25, 1961. I believe that this nation should commit itself to achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the Earth. This ambitious goal was driven by the intense space race between the United States and the Soviet Union, a key aspect of the Cold War. Apollo 11 was launched from Kennedy Space Center on Merritt Island, Florida, on July 16, 1969, atop the powerful Saturn V rocket. The crew consisted of Commander Neil Armstrong, Command Module Pilot Michael Collins, and Lunar Module Pilot Edwin Buzz Aldrin. The spacecraft comprised three parts, the Command Module Columbia, the Service Module, and the Lunar Module Eagle. After a journey of four days, the Lunar Module Eagle separated from the Command Module and descended to the Moon's surface. On July 20, 1969, the Eagle landed in the Sea of Tranquility, a flat lunar basin. We copy you down, Eagle. Houston, uh, Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. Roger, Twink. Tranquility, we copy you on the ground. You got a bunch of guys about to turn blue. We're breathing again. Thanks a lot. Over six hours later, astronaut Neil Armstrong became the first person to step onto the surface of the moon. Okay, Neil, we can see you coming down the ladder now. I'm going to step off the limb now. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Armstrong was soon joined by Aldrin, and together they spent over two hours outside the lunar module, collecting samples, conducting experiments, and taking photographs. For those who haven't uh, read the plaque, uh, we'll read the plaque that's on the front landing gear of this lamb. There's, there's two hemispheres, one showing each of the two hemispheres of Earth. Underneath it says, Dear men from the planet Earth, first set foot upon the moon, July 1969, AP. It came in peace for all mankind. After spending 21 hours and 36 minutes on the lunar surface, Armstrong and Aldrin lifted off in the lunar module's ascent stage to rejoin Collins in the command module. The crew then began their journey back to Earth, splashing down in the Pacific Ocean on July 24, 1969. The success of Apollo 11 was a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. It demonstrated that with vision, dedication, and teamwork, seemingly impossible goals could be achieved. The mission not only fulfilled President Kennedy's challenge, but also inspired generations to dream big and strive for the stars. The Apollo 11 mission remains a symbol of what humanity can accomplish when united by a common goal. It paved the way for future space exploration and continues to inspire scientific and technological advancements today. As we look back on this historic event, we are reminded of the boundless potential of human endeavor and the enduring spirit of exploration.